up in the morning. <laughs> uh, we got in yesterday, but we were a little tired because we uh, left another camping trip. <laughs> yeah. We had just left um, another group camping trip with a bunch of mini lighters. And we just really wanted to come and yeah. chill. Chill, exactly. <laughs> so it was a laid back late afternoon and evening yesterday. But we're getting uh, getting started bright and early this morning. Yep. Um, we're, tell them where we're at. Pokagon State Park in Indiana. Um, it's near, I think it's Angolia is the Angolia, town. Angolia, yeah. yeah. And we um, stopped here on the way north last year to uh, Van Buren State Park in Michigan. It was just an overnight stay. Yeah. But we thought we liked it. Mm -hmm. We wanted to see more of it. Yeah. So we decided to come back and see what it was all about. Yeah. So uh, we're here for a couple nights on our way back home. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately. <laughs> oh well, we all got to go home sometime, right? <laughs> but anyway, the um, the park itself looks really pretty. We really liked it last time we were here. Yeah. So um, we're hoping to get out and um, just explore. Check, yeah. Yeah, check things out. Check everything out. And uh, we'll let you know what we find. Yep. Okay, so sorry, we come no, back. Sorry, sorry. So From our camper window, we get a little shot of the lake down below through the trees. So it's kind of nice. And we're up on a hill, so you kind of overlook the, some of the campground in this area. We're headed to the camp store. Uh, they looks like they rent bikes. Uh, they got ice, firewood, all kind of cool stuff. <laughs> Everything you need at a camp store. Exactly. take you into the women's restroom to let you see what it looks like. So they walk in and there's, I don't know, let's see, three stalls. There's the strips. And then you've got your sink in the mirror area. And then to the right, there are two showers. And they're pretty wide, they're pretty big. And then the second one over here is for heating and shower. But as you can tell, they're uh, they're really pretty clean. And then they're all uh, well maintained. So yeah, I'd say uh, the showers and the restroom facilities look nice. It's at least for the area we're in. We're heading to the beach. This beach is for the kink round, I believe. There's another beach that's up for up near the inn. Potatawami Inn. I think I said that right. <laughs> but this one's down closer to the campground. I think we're heading the right way. I've never walked down a trail to the beach before. So we'll see what's down here. <laughs> It's not Daytona, but it's a beach. 
It's a nice beach. It is nice. The beach is pretty nice. The water is clear. I mean, it's pretty clear. You can see pretty far down in the beach area. I like it. We need to bring lawn chairs down the next time we come and sit on the beach. This is the Potawatomi Inn here at Hokagan State Park. See me coming in this one. <laughs> Should she get it or not? <laughs> no, I say not. <laughs> I kind of like it. It's a little bright. I am. The view off of the um, the end is pretty. And they've got their own little beach down there. Playground, volleyball court, fire pit. Anything you'd ever need. Now we're at the nature center here. And they're doing some construction it looks like. But they're still open, except for Mondays and Tuesdays. Now we just happen to be here on a Monday or a Tuesday. <laughs> uh, well, here on a Monday <laughs> and a Tuesday. <laughs> oh well, but looks like they're doing a nice job with it. I think they're getting ready to pour some concrete. I think so. Well, we're headed on another trail. <laughs> this one is trail number three. And it takes us to something called Hell's Point. And it's 84 steps up to Hell's Point. Sounds point. to me a little more like... Like what? Heart attack hill or something. <laughs> heart attack point. <laughs> heart attack point. <laughs> it's 2.2 .2 miles. I think we can handle it. It is moderate to... What's that other word? Moderate to rugged. Rugged. <laughs> Wish us the best.
Well, we made it to Hell's Point, but apparently we, it's a loop trail. Apparently we came up on the side without the steps. All so, right. <laughs> lucky for us, we have to walk down 84 steps instead of up them. But it's the, it's the highest point in the park. It's 1,123 feet above sea level here. It's the third highest point in the county. Well, we did it. <laughs> we made it back. We did. Would you do it again? I would. It wasn't so bad at all. No. And uh, we got to see a lot of wildlife. We had yep. a ton of squirrels, even more chipmunks, and a raccoon. Yep. And I think they have more chipmunks here than any place in the whole world. They're everywhere. <laughs> but anyhow, the trails were, uh, the trail was well maintained. Well marked too. We passed a bunch of other trails and all of them were real, uh, marked really well. So yeah, good trail system here at Pokagon. Yep, sure is. <laughs> So the toboggan slide is a 90 foot vertical drop and the track is a half a mile and the record speed on this is 42 mile an hour. Obviously it only runs through the winter months but I think he said like 90,000 people go down, down this a season. It's a lot of people. Watch it slide down on one right there. It's pretty scary to me. Once they put ice on it. <laughs> or to refrigerate it. It does look like a lot of fun. Well, this is some more to the toboggan run. Towards the end of it. Towards the end of it. <laughs> we can't even see the building it's, at the top. It's way up there. Right here's the where you end at. I think it actually ends just past that gate. Yeah. It shoots you up over there. Push up over the building. Yeah, I just <laughs> no, it does not. <laughs> 42 mile an hour though, that's pretty fast. Yeah, that's moving out. There's Find some it. cabins. There's uh, cabins right down here too. And uh, I know they've redone a couple of them. Chris is going to walk out and see if anybody's home. <laughs> see if they'll give us a tour. I want to see if there's anybody in it. Oh, you want to see if anybody's in it? Yeah. Oh, goodness. No, well, this one's not occupied. It's like two beds and a bathroom. beds like two beds and a bathroom but it looks like I think there's four there's a little kitchenette in there <laughs> all right I'm, I'm done peeping in the windows <laughs> Got a peeping Christy. well we're getting ready to leave Pokagon State Park here in Angola Indiana we had a great weekend uh, it's a nice park Yes, it is. Uh, the campground itself is roughly 200 electric sites and I think around 70 non-electric. The beach here is 
one of the nicest beaches I've ever seen at a campground. Yeah, it's it's a great. It's and not real big, but you know it's clean and really nice. You got a ice cream shop and snack shop and. And the lake here um, is developed. The uh, state park sits on one side or one part of the lake, and the rest of it is developed. Um, but uh, but it's great. I mean, the, you saw the trail we took. Um, really nice. Lots of playgrounds for the kids. The restrooms were clean. Yeah, the restrooms are super clean. Uh, we had breakfast this morning in the inn. What did you think of the breakfast? Oh, the breakfast was great. You got a lot of food. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't eat it all. Way more than what you would even want. It was great. Yeah. Um, we can't say anything really negative about it. Um, I guess if we had something to say, though, it would be the campgrounds. Um, some of the campsites are a little oddly shaped. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, it's all under trees, so you're not going to get a lot of grass. If you get grass, it's going to be, you know, thin. It's not going to be the lush green grass. Um, so I just say if you're booking, just, um, you know, make sure you read the... Um, the sizes of the the campsites and yeah things. the turns going in and out are pretty tight if you have a big rig yeah but there are plenty of great sites there are just some that you know yeah we had we saw a camper that had to move because he couldn't get his camper in the site so yeah that's kind of why we give you that heads up right <laughs> but anyways um great time great weather yes perfect weather unfortunately we have to go home yep <laughs> so we'll wrap this up that's what we think of the campground Hopefully you guys can get out here and check it out. Uh, don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you like the video. Please subscribe. And hit that bell so you don't miss our next one.